Hey guys, it is me, Happy Star again. Welcome back to Last Standard Survival. So, season 19 continues, and we will keep grinding through the season pass. And also, check this out today. We've gotten a brand new thing. So, apparently, from uh, 11th of February on weekend, there will be some sort of weekend's rush in Bunker Alpha. So, you'll be able to get some of these special points and open up these special chests here. But. Uh, all of that stuff later today. We're also gonna do some raids. We're gonna open up purple crates, etc, etc But all of that stuff later I'll just like to remind you that this is a live stream So head to the pin comments down below there are gonna be timestamps So click on these timestamps and go to your favorite part of the live stream quicker and now let's start uh, Taking care of our base just as always we have to take care of this refined melting furnace and I feel like today's the time for us to go to the whatever that place is called, Dead Island, because I'm kind of running low on titanium. We only have like two titanium ores, so maybe, 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 maybe we're going to go and get some more titanium because I still need to kind of finish my walls. There are still some walls left to finish off this base. And hey, welcome to all of those that just joined the stream. Welcome, welcome, everybody. Glad to see you here. Welcome, welcome, peeps. Hello, hello. Hello, hello. Um... Uh, we've also recycled some stuff here and I've gotten zero titanium Zero well, whatever I'll put back those ten titanium fragment suit pieces Maybe now we'll get at least something useful even though I highly doubt it, but hey It is what it is and hey welcome welcome once again everybody to those that just joined so hey welcome welcome uh, Welcome welcome little by little we are preparing to open up a purple crate. I didn't mean to move those things, but oops Oops, oops, oops. So yeah, we're gonna open up some purple crates. Perhaps we'll do 99 waves. I'm not really certain of it. I think we will also go to the hard mode laboratory because... Yeah. Yesterday we've cleared the laboratory in normal mode. So I feel like we could go today to the hard mode laboratory and clear it there. So that's another thing that we're gonna do. We have lots of stuff planned for today. Here go the campfires are done. Everything is done except this thing. And here go this refined melting furnace is... Working as well. I don't think there's anything else that we need to set up here Besides more cement bags, we're kind of running low on cement bags So we got to get some cement bags the more cement bags the better Where's the next God of War episode in free to play? Maybe perhaps hopefully one day somewhere soon. I don't know Soon the short answer is soon hopefully maybe Uh, Wait, what else are we doing? Oh, yeah, we got to get the ghillie armor just as always we're going for the swamp location We got to get a little bit of ash trees But my ghillie suit is almost broken Disgusting and you might be like well, it's like for how long do I have uh, will you farm these ash trees? I have no idea as soon as we finish off the base then I don't think we'll have to ever go to the swamp location so I still need maybe more ash logs here and there, but soon we'll have to stop going to the ash location. I guess that's cool. Maybe a few more runs uh, and we're done. Let's get these... Hatchets. Let's get some guns. And hey, how are you doing peeps on this? I'm pretty certain, yes, indeed, it's Sunday. So how you're doing, guys, on this Sunday? Oh, and also one more thing that I'd like to check out, because yesterday we've cleared the calendar thing, the laboratory rush thing. Oh, and the tasks haven't reset, so I have two days to do all of these tasks. Okay, understandable, have a nice day, and then we'll have this bunker alpha weekend's rush, okay. Okay, 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 understandable, have a nice day. Dying Light 2 looks cool as well. Keep it up, Psych. Thank you, Shadow Duffer, for watching Dying Light 2. There will be more Dying Light 2, of course. There will be more other games as well. For those asking for God of War or whatever else that we're playing here. So there will be obviously more videos on everything. Hmm, I'll take a flare gun with me. Why not? I fancy a flare gun today. Let's get a flare gun. Uh, let's get a shovel or two. Here go, let's get two, three shovels. Even though that's way too many shovels, but a better more than not enough. Let's also get some food with us before we leave this place. When there are more free to play videos, when there is, when I come up with something to do in free to play, guys. Because currently there is nothing else left to do besides doing Bunker Alpha, unless you want to see me clear another Bunker Alpha with wall tricks there. And if you'd like to see that, then just watch the previous free to play video, as it's going to be the exact same video. So, yeah, as soon as I come up with something interesting to do in the free to play, then there will be another episode. 
But the only thing that's left for us to do in the free to play is grinding Bunker Alpha. But yeah, after I unlock the farm location, we might go to the farm location there. Um, let's eat this. Yeah, I think we're done. That's it. Let's go. Let's hop on the ATV and let's battle from our base. I'm kind of sad that we didn't get a revenge raid today. I was hoping that we'd get a revenge raid. But we didn't get it. Sadly. Sadly, sadly. But hey, we're going to do tasks over here and then we'll do a revenge raid. We'll also clear the farm location. Speaking of farm location, as soon as we are back from the far from the swamp location, we are going to that swamp location. So I Let's prepare for it. Let's hop on the ATV. When is season 20? After season 19, then there's season 20. I have no idea when on earth season 20 is coming. The season 19 has just started, so don't dream about season 20 yet. Okay, let's go to the swamp location and just as always let's get four stacks and let's leave this place let's get four stacks of ash logs and then we can leave it and hey welcome everybody to the stream hello hello so for those who didn't know we are clearing here the swamp location i'm trying to get four stacks of ash logs and then we will go to the swamp locate to the farm location i think we'll do a raid and yeah the purple card is waiting for us Mayhaps 99 waves. I'm not really certain about that, but we might do this. We also need to grind for some titanium. See a lots of things that we have to do. Alright, we already had four ash logs. Let's get more. Before we do this, we might as well get some more peat. So yeah, let's shovel some peat into our backpack. Who remembers Days Gone so fresh golden? I remember Days Gone. That was a great game. This gun was amazing. Did you get the purple off of the event yet, Psych? As Jamie, you're welcome to the stream. And no, I haven't gotten a purple card yet off of the event. Off of the... I think there are two ways to get the purple card. You can get the purple card from killing Nian. And you can get the purple card from opening up those special chests. Okay, let's deal with the squeaker. Oh no, oh no, oh no, oh no. Didn't need to pick up any of that. Okay, let's quickly split this. Uh, what else I wanted to show you? I keep misclicking the button here in the calendar. There are these rewards, and sometimes here you can get a purple card. So either from those new special chests or from killing Nian, I think on fourteenth Nian or whenever you get that box, uh, get that purple card. Any permanent uh, content this update? The only permanent thing in this update is emotional damage. That's it. There is nothing permanent during this update. At least I don't think so. Okay, let's deal with this dude. Let's get the beans. I'm gonna get the duct tape. Uh oh. Of course, these stupid AI are gonna trigger all the zombies in this area. Also, by clearing this farm location, we are in this swamp location, we are killing zombies and we are progressing further in our season pass. There's a new content event on calendar for Bunker Alpha, yes. On 11th of February, there will be Weekend's Rush for Bunker Alpha. Except we don't really get that many points on that Weekend's Rush, which I think is total bullcrap. I mean, check this out. We have gotten many more points. On the laboratories, we can rush, so we don't see even rewards, but we were able to get 30 points for killing 90 zombies there, but... Hey, in Bunker Alpha, we don't get 30 points there, we only get 15. So, it's kind of sad, in my opinion, we should have gotten more points. But it is what it is. What level are you on the season pass now? So, I'm currently on level 30. I've just gotten that treadmill. Which doesn't do anything, it's just there at the base. Treadmill is just there for the memes. Okay, let's deal with the carrion. Let's get the rest of these trees.
One permanent thing is the up and down treadmill, says Chris. Yes, yes, of course we've gotten permanent content. We have gotten the treadmill. And also some more backpack skins and other stuff. Okay, sorry, what faction are you planning to choose in Dying Light 2? I'll be probably playing for the survivors. I think I've already... You can already see that in the videos. I already started playing for survivors there. All right, let's deal with the squeaker. Sayonara, mate. Uh oh, my character started stinking, so as soon as we get back to the base, we'll have to take a shower. <coughs> Almost shocked in water. You just push the ATV home. Yes, every time you run out of gasoline, your character will just push the ATV home. It is what it is. Uh, nothing useful from this enemy. Well, I'll deal with the swamp loader. Here go Dunzo. I guess the only good part about this season, when I think about it, is that for killing zombies, we can progress in our season pass. And you have to kill a lot of zombies, but at least, hey, you can still clear your bunker alpha every two days. And you can progress in the season pass, which I think is going to be pretty hard to get to, le to the last level. Oh my goodness, I didn't mean to aggro all of them. Hero got him. But you don't really even have to get to the last level in the season pass. I mean, the last rewards are kind of cool. But if you don't really have full season pass, then... Probably getting to the last rewards is pointless. It's only worth it to probably get the chopper if you still don't have the chopper. Other than that, it's pointless to go to the very, very last rewards, I think. But hey, good luck to everyone with the season pass. In 33 waves, I received 9 blue and 45 brown and 10 green. That's a lot of uh, blue cards in 33 waves. Congrats on that. We might do 99 waves today as well. I have no idea what we're going to get there. Can't guess anything. But hey, as long as I'm going to get like 10 blue, I'll be happy. So yeah, hopefully we'll get at least 10 blue cards. I'm going for the backpack with a little zam zam. Oh, the last backpack there. Yeah, that's permanent content as well. For those people asking, were there any permanent content added? during this update, and yes. There was that treadmill here, that was permanent content, and this skin. Where is it? Here go, this. This zombie. This backpack. Which is kinda cool. Maybe it's not such a bad backpack. Maybe even I'll equip it once or twice, if we get it. It's like, what should I do after getting very rich from Bunker Alpha? Uh, you continue clearing Bunker Alpha to get even more rich. Thank you, Saik! Thank you for helping me! You're welcome. You are absolutely welcome. You're mostly... You're welcome. Let's leave this place and let's go to another red location. What was the last permanent location added to this game? I have no idea. I have no idea. Maybe Bunker Alpha. No, I have no idea what was the last location added to the game. I don't remember. Motel probably. No, the laboratory. Laboratory was the last permanent location added to the game. Unless I'm mistaken and there was something else, but I think laboratory was the last one. 
But it also aside, if you've gotten rich from Bunker Alpha, then clear Bunker Bravo two, three times and then repeat your process again from getting very rich from Bunker Alpha. And rinse and repeat that after you assemble your ATV, then I don't know. Start a new account, maybe. <laughs> I don't know. I have no idea. Okay, let's deal with the swamp zombies. That's it, my flare gun is broken. Flare gun, flare gun's done, so. Alrighty, we found a bag. Let's load the bag. Oh, we even got an a Glock here in this bag. Okay. Almost a full durability Glock, not six out of garbage Glock. I mean, it's more like 60%, 70% durability Glock, but it's still a pretty nice Glock. In my opinion, pretty nice luck. Yo, Madison Jones, thank you for the super chat. Welcome to the stream. Hello, hello, Madison. Welcome, welcome. Glad to see you here. Welcome, welcome. And we are almost out of this. We're gonna get out of this swamp location real soon. Just basically one and a half more stacks, even less than that, and we can leave this place. Oh, but luckily we've gotten some more peat. So let's get some more peat. I started building my ATV two weeks ago. I have four ATV transmissions. And now I'll be done in like a year. Uh, well, hopefully you'll be able to assemble your ATV soon. Hopefully. Alrighty, more ash logs. Uh, oh, even more peat. Obviously, I'll bring that peat back to the base. Even though we still have a lot of peat at the base, we have like, what, maybe over 100 peat, but we need more peat. There's always more peat. Yo, Krasdals, welcome to the stream. Welcome, welcome. Hello, hello. Are the transmission odds reduced? I got one in a second jack, but I have no idea what you're talking about, but I have no idea. Maybe. Maybe, maybe. <laughs> Madison Jones, thank you for the super chat. <laughs> welcome to the stream once again. Welcome, welcome. It's like, does Salmon Soup give still an extra ash log? Um, not certain. No, it's it's random. It doesn't always give you an extra log. It's just a chance of getting an extra log. Before you could get a guaranteed extra log in the swamp location, but now there's only a chance to get it. So maybe every tenth tree you'll get an extra log or something. So it's not really worth it to get that salmon soup. That's why I never cook it. Is boat worth it before the ATV? I can craft the boat before the ATV. Because boat is much easier to assemble than ATV. So most likely you're gonna assemble the boat before the ATV. Will we ever try Uncharted series? I think I've seen Let's Plays of Uncharted. I think I've seen the entire Uncharted. I'm not really certain if I remember correctly. But I think I've seen it. All right, another ash tree here. How many more ash trees do we need? We need like 10 more, but we are running out of them in this location. That's it, swab bloater is dead. Wall chicken is hard and mobile. Uh, wait, where is the... Yeah, it says Nazarene. I have no idea, some people say. That is harder. Some people say that it's easy, so I don't know. I think it's just it just depends. I need to practice on whichever device you play. And then you'll be able to do the wall trick. You have to someday play Horizon Zero Dawn. 
Horizon Zero Dawn. Isn't it like the robot shooter survival something game, if I'm not mistaken? I can really check it. Horizon Zero Dawn. I think I heard of it. Oh no, it's a different game. Okay, it's different. It's That's what I thought. I think I might have played it again. I think I might have played it for myself long ago, I think. Again, triple question mark. I think maybe. That's it, we are done. We've gotten four stacks, so we can leave it. What do you think is better, Days Gone or Dying Light? Uh, Days Gone or Dying Light uh, as fresh golden? Once again, I don't really like comparing anything, like saying this thing is better than the other thing, as I think both of those games are great. So, yeah, I haven't finished Dying Light 2 yet. I can't really say much about, about the story in Dying Light 2. I have no idea. But I really love the story in Days Gone. And Days Gone was fun, fun game to play. I don't know, I don't see a point of saying which game is better than the other. I think both of those games are great. I love both of those games. And I still love them, so yeah, I don't have a favorite game. As I said, I think it's pretty silly. The Those questions are like, hey, what's your favorite thing? What do, what do you think is better? I like everything. Both of those games are awesome. And yo, Lila Bears, welcome to the stream. Welcome, welcome. Hello, hello. All right, let's quickly sort out the inventory. Let's drop the loot that we've gotten. I'm pretty certain now there are more zombies. There are more and more zombies coming through. So they're all dead because the game here started kind of lagging and I was like, wait, something's going on. And every time it lags, I usually know that that means zombies are attacking us. Um, Let's drop these things over here. Bam, bam. Bam, bam. Let's go. Let's take a shower real quick. And let's probably go to the swamp location. And no water. That's why I always want to keep water here. I'm going to delete these empty bottles that said empty bottles gone. Oh my god, Zyg, I can't believe you've done that. That's it. Empty bottles gone. And I'll be able to take 60 bottles there. I'll drop the hatchets. I'll drop the other stuff. Hmm. Hmm. Anything else that I'd like to drop here? Nothing. Probably nothing. Yo, Madison Jones, I've been watching this channel for a long time. Thank you for watching it for a long time. Glad to see you here. Thank you for the super chat. Welcome, welcome to the stream once again. I'm glad that you're enjoying the videos or live streams. Let's drop the duct tape. The red ticket goes to this chest. Neon looks like three times richer than the big one. Yeah, Neon zombie here in this game looks like he, he has the drip. He has those chains, he has everything. Neon indeed has the drip. We might even find some more Neons today. Shovel, 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 shovel goes there. Um, this other stuff goes there. And call Python. Nice. That's it. We have sorted out our inventory. Beautiful. Let's get rid of this ghillie suit that we have now. Let's equip this. There's something that I'd like though. Wait, I want to see how many caps we have. We might go to the, to the place and spin some caps, but we only have 444 caps, so it's not really that much worth it. Okay, let's get this. Let's get some more water. Uh, what else do we have to do? I'm thinking, I'm thinking, I'm thinking, I'm thinking. Steam is pouring out of my ears. Guns, that's what we got to take. Because we are going to the farm location.
Well, that's a lot of guns that we've taken. Okay, a few melee weapons. I have no idea why on earth it takes always so much time to prepare to go somewhere. But hey, let's get uh, melee weapons. Let's go, let's go. Yo, welcome to those that just joined the stream. Welcome, welcome, everybody. Hello, hello. Welcome, welcome. Dilly Dilly says happy Sunday. Happy Sunday to you, mate. Welcome, welcome. Happy Sunday to all of you. The video is blurry. Try to change the quality. There are the... Depends on where you're watching, either on desktop or on mobile. Change the quality from 144p to at least 360p and it should stop being blurry. Or you can contact your internet service provider. You're welcome. Let's up on the chopper and let's go to the farm location. That's it. We gotta go kill three balls. We also open up the blue crate, obviously. We'll kill the Avenger. Why are you over preparing for the farm lo location? Just take two melee and two guns. Uh, that's enough. You must be the. You must be new here. It's probably your first time watching the live stream. So you welcome to the stream. Welcome to Happy Sykes live stream where we over prepare for everything. Welcome, welcome. Hello, hello. Okay, let's load the car. Like, what should I do after completing my chopper bunker alpha to get more guns? Thank you, Psych, for these tips and tricks. You're welcome. You're absolutely welcome. Uh, do I have any broken weapons that I'd like to break first? Here, go like this Glock, for example. Let's break it. I've gotten 13 extra points. Um, bunch of zombies over there. Okay, the blue box isn't there, so I'm not even gonna go there. I won't fight them. I know we could have just left this place and that's it, but I, it's just faster to kill them. Let's get another probably kind of have broken Glock. Oh no, there's the infected bull. I accidentally aggroed it, but I, luckily we have to kill these three bulls in order to go for the raid. So this was a good accident. Clearing farm worth it? Asks Chris. Probably not. I think it depends on what you want to get. If you want to get melee blueprints, then yes. But other than that, I don't think it's worth it. Uh, yes, there's the blue box. Bunch of zombies are attacking us. It's not expensive to clear it, but you don't really get any useful loot here. At least I don't think so. Again, after I clear it on the free-to-play account, I'll... Maybe I'll have a better opinion on it, but so far it seems useless. As I said, if you're clearing Bunker Alpha every two days, there is nothing else you need to clear in this game. You're not going to get anything else. Well, also, police department. You can open up brown crates. Okay, let's get this gun as it has less durability. Let's deal with the Savage Giant. The waves give you points. No, the waves do not give you points, sadly. That is very sad. Oops, oops, oops. I didn't even see the Savage Iron there. Let's pick this thing up. It 
Psych, can you see sound and hear colors? Um, it's a very deep question. Up the rotten yokel. Let's deal with the savage giant. And somewhere up there, there has to be that revenger. But I'm gonna bring the blue box a bit, a bit higher. Pick up the puppy. I picked up the puppy, guys. <sighs> Why do you want me to pick him up and not feed him? That's it. It's up to you. It's your fault, peeps. I wanted to open up five purple cars today, but just because of this. Uh, this thing, that's it guys. Zero purple cards. No, I'm kidding. I'm gonna open up only one purple card. So yeah, I wanted to open up five purple cards, but because of the, these comments, spamming me to get the puppy, that's it. Only one purple card. That's it. It's time for you guys to pay for your mess. It's time for you to pay for your mess. But Cyric! I don't want to hear any butts here. I told you what's gonna happen. Alright, so the dude's gonna spit real soon. Sorry, Psych, please forgive us. It's too late! It doesn't matter if I forgive you or not. It's too late. It is too late. It is too late. I rescued the puppy. But for what price? That puppy costed you guys four purple cards. And just like that, Revenger is almost dead. Take a one more attack, bam, Revenger is dead. Shredded into smithereens. Let's get some bandages here. Also, guys, another question that I'd like to ask is how many points we've gotten from killing the Revenger? I didn't really see. Did we get 100 points? Have we gotten 100 points, more or less? As I haven't really paid attention. There go, the second infected bull is dead. 150 points. Thank you guys for the info. So apparently we've gotten 150 points. Okay, that's cool. Sadly, we only get 16 points from bulls. Feel like we should be getting more, but whatever. Delete the puppy. Nah, why would I delete it? I already picked it up. It's too late. What level are you on the battle pass? I don't remember level one, th uh, level 30. Yeah, we're level 31 actually now. We've just leveled up. We are level 30. So let's drop the blue box somewhere over here. Um, let's get the machete. Oops. Didn't mean to stand up. Wanted to sneak behind that right yokel. But hey. From the blind one you get 200 maybe. I have no idea. I haven't paid attention. I don't think I have killed a blind one yet during this new update. But yeah, I'll believe you that it's, it's got to be 200. It's around 200. 150, 200, maybe 250. But yeah, I believe you that it's 200. Let's get inside of the farm. And once again, as soon as I'll start looting this shelf, I'm pretty certain someone might attack us. Look at this. I just mentioned them. Here go, raiders have attacked me. These schmucks. Here go, they're dead.
Let's destroy the rotten Yoko. Let's get the other guy. Whatever his name is. Savage Giant. Let's go. Let's kill the Savage Giant. Here we've gotten the big freaking hammer. Blueprint. Don't really need it. Um, we've gotten doggo treats. And here's some more duct tape. Thank you very much. Very cool. So yeah, I think it's time for us to open up that blue box. Let's go, let's drop it here. Onto this metal cutter. Let's also get the spread shot. The farm door here might open up. If that's the keyword, it might open up. Okay, gotta wait for my spread shot. But also gotta deal with these diseased wolfos. Stupid diseased wolf, they're so fast, they're they're biting you so fast. They're annoying me. That's all I have to say. My poor armor, stop it! Oops, didn't mean to get stuck there. Well, I'm gonna hide behind the wall. Okay, some of them can attack me. My armor is almost destroyed. We got another spread shot. Yikes, poor armor. That's all I have to say. Just yikes and poor armor. Well, I'm gonna re-enter this place to go and open up that blue box. You're gonna have to put on smelly raider clothes. Nah, we still have enough. Uh, it's about a break. Maybe you're right. But it will survive. Maybe I won't have to pick up that garbage armor. God of War tomorrow, please. Maybe there will be God of War tomorrow. Again, can't promise anything. Maybe. Maybe tomorrow. Maybe after tomorrow. Let's get here a Glock. I saw another poppy in the barn. It's your lucky day. Thank you. We'll get another poppy from the barn. Oh boy, can't get, can't wait to get him. All right, so I'm gonna just go down there. I hate these stupid haystacks. Uh, some zombies might come out of these haystacks, but hopefully they don't. Said I'm gonna wait here. See, the gun doesn't even work. There were no sound with the gun because probably there were too many savage giants. Sprinting. Well, I didn't take the sprinting kill skill, sadly, so I'll have to walk like this on foot like peasant. I'll have to run like a peasant. Uh, what I've gotten? A machete bone handle. This is so sad. Very sad. Survivor notes. But I need a machete blueprint, but I need a purple machete blueprint, not this one. Okay, I'll have to do one more loop to loot that place there. So let's go down there. Kill the last bull. I have killed all the bulls, haven't I? What do you mean kill the last bull? I've killed all the bulls, I've killed three bulls, I've killed the bull there, and I've killed the bull there, unless I haven't killed the third bull, but I think I killed all three bulls. Well, I'll go to the top through the other side, and we'll see what's up. Oh no, these schmucks have spawned! Yeah, I've killed uh, all three bulls here. I killed all three of them. Will I have enough time to loot this thing? Well, I kind of don't need anything. But these savage giants might come here and they might clap me. I'll be very sad. Oh, that's it. We did it. We survived. Everything's fine.
So let's get back now to the base and let's release those two puppies from the boxes. And let's, let's go for the raid, I guess. Kill them for season points. Nah, I'm not going to be killing them for season points. They're going to soak up lots of weapons. I mean, we could kill them, honestly. We could probably kill them. There's the... Rest stop. Should have taken that broken, stinky armor because there's no way I'll be able to do rest up with these, with this stuff. So I'll sayonara probably rest up. Or I should go there. Should I go there? If I die the rest up with all of this loot, I'll be kind of sad. Hopefully I don't die. Hopefully I don't die. Hopefully I don't die. Well, let's see what kind of event is this. All right, let's wait for more of them to come in here and I'll probably kill them. Set them out of armor. There you got him. Didn't even have to get new armor. Here you go, an M16, another Glock, and uh, nothing else. So let's go to the top. Let's loot those choppers. And Sahil Khan, thank you for the super chat. Welcome to the stream. Welcome, welcome. And hey, luckily. There are no zombies. A zip gun! A zip gun! A zip gun in the chopper. Unbelievable. Um... Here we go, the, gal, the Glock fits. Beautiful, so let's leave this place now. Zip gun for Frenzy Giants, yes. I mean, the Zip gun for Frenzy Giants, all right. If you don't want to wall trick them, you can use the Zip gun in Frenzy Giants, actually. But hey, let's get back home. And this place is going to be set only in 50 minutes, in an hour. Hmm. Seriously, that's a big hmm. There's a new event in the cal calendar. Yes, indeed, there's a new event. It's 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 not there. It's just it just exists. It says that it'll start on 11th of February. So that new event is not there yet. But yeah, it will be Bunker Alpha Weekends Rush. Let's drop the guns. Let's drop the guns. Uh, plop. The melee, 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 melee. Wait, maybe. actually, it's too late. I've already sorted out most of the inventory. Let's let out the puppies. And your name is Holy. Holy. Uh, Molly. Uh, Gooper. Pepper. More like salt. Am I right? <laughs> no, I'm kidding. It's just going to be Gooper. Go back to the doggo crate. Mm -hmm. Let's go. Let's get another armor. Like whichever one. Another tactical armor. Here I'm going to drop some gasoline, some iron. And some whatever other miscellaneous resources. Yo, BJ, welcome to the stream. Welcome, welcome. And that's it. I can drop now just the 10 caps and let's see what other tasks we have to do for raiders. Is your warehouse full? Yes, the warehouse is full, full. The warehouse is filled to the brim. Two engines can't get them. This stuff cannot get it. We gotta get a C4 though, which we can get from the inbox. Yeah, we can get a C4 from the inbox. Let's go to weapons. Let's get a C4. And the only thing that's left first is to get a stack of first aid kits. Let's grab those stack of first aid kits and let's go for the raid. Wait, not for the raid, but for the stack of first aid kits and let's go for the raid. We, 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 we. So stack of first aid kits. 
One, two, three. Let's get two of those. Okay, well, there are the first eight kits. Let's craft them. Do you have the samurai armor? Yes, I think we've gotten it. Can you even get it during the season? Probably you can, I don't know. But it doesn't really have a lot of durability. Will we play Subnautica? I've actually... We've played Subnautica 1 here on the channel already. Might continue with the Subnautica below zero. Maybe. Mayhaps. Let's drop this thing here. Um... More first aid kits. That's it. I think we are ready to go for the raid. I just need to tell the raiders to skedaddle. So let's go. Let's talk to the raiders. Will we play SNAF Security Breach? Probably no. Um, gotta upgrade the guns, gotta get the hatchets. Let's go, let's get the five hatchets over here. Let's get the... Um, some stones, maybe, and a little bit of wood. Let's go to resources, let's get stack of common logs, let's get stack of limestone. Yeah, we're kind of running low on stones. Little by little. Two, three, four, uh, five. I think we're done. We are ready to go for the raid. Let's go. Let's do research on the raid. Let's do some research. Gotta feed the doggos 20,000 turkeys. No, 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 no. The doggos are fed. The doggos are fed. Look at their bowl here. It's full. Look at the doggos' ball. Full! Full! There is no need to feed them. I don't think I've spoken to raiders that we have to click OK. Or maybe I've already clicked OK. I don't remember. Yes. That's already done. Say, so let's go outside. Let's do a little bit of research on the raid. And yeah. Maybe it's gonna be a nice base. Oof, again, another player base. I'm sick and tired of raiding these player bases. But it is what it is. I think I've even raided this base quite recently, not gonna lie. Um. All right. Okay. What is this life, peeps? Well, that's it. I am ready to go for the raid. Let's start driving to the base. Apparently, we will require two C4s for this raid. So let's get a second C4. Let's go to weapons. Let's get our... No, I didn't mean to get three C4s! That is sad. That's not sad. I don't know what's sad. It's like feed the dog was 300 turkey for the sake of education. That's the silliest education I've ever seen. That is very stupid. I'm not doing that, so stop it. Get some help. I don't remember if I need a C4 here. Maybe I don't need a C4 on this wall. Or maybe I do, I don't remember. Yeah, I still need a C4, so let's place a C4 here. Oh... By him, it's going to explode. Okay, I don't think there are any more zombies. Oh no, there are more. Okay, go, we've just exploded one more wall. And here we have more chests. 
you get the inspector card from the season? No, I haven't gotten any inspector card yet. I haven't gotten any inspector cards from the season yet. Uh, how many chests are there? Okay, four chests. Let's go. Let's start it off. We've got in the bowl. Thank you, but do not need it. Uh, crowbar. Thank you, but do not need that either. Um, some iron. Let's get that into the pocket. Let's get a little bit of iron. Duct tape. And some red tickets. More gasoline. Okay, could have been worse in my opinion. We've gotten some food. Uh, okay. And two more chests left. Maybe I can open these chests up even before the... Before they spawn. I think they have already spawned. Alright, they're here. I've gotten basically pieces of cloth, which I don't care. And here an electronic circuit. Yes, yes, yes. I was able to leave this place without even fighting that third wave of zombies, so... I don't really know if this base gets Ike's approval. It doesn't really have lots of loot. So, nah, it's not worth it. This base does not get Ike's approval. Nah, nah, we didn't get anything useful. I don't even know why I spent time thinking about it. We got nothing. Absolutely nothing. It's like, which is better to build a boat or a TV? Probably both, because I don't think you'll be able to build a TV anytime soon anyways. So I'll probably go for the boat. The raid get a 10 out of 10 though. The raid doesn't even get 0 out of 10. The raid is in the negatives. The raid is like negative 5 maybe. I mean, we got some food. We got some carrots, so not terrible. Obviously not terrible, but not great either. Let's drop that here and let's go. Let's give the raiders that electronic circuit and let's call them again. Any wave of zombies, perhaps perhaps we also have to kill the Revenger, but we've just killed him. So yeah, we might go for the second raid. Uh I don't know when. Like perhaps now the second raid, raid number two. I guess we could go for it. Let's go raid number two, ladies and gents. Let's craft a stack of uh, let's craft a new tactical armor. Let's go for the raid number two. Let's go, let's get this. Let's get some thick cloth. Um, perhaps a little bit of rope. Triple question mark. We could get a little bit of rope. Um, I don't remember where I dropped the rope. I don't know where I've dropped the rope. Here go 12 rope. I don't know if that's enough for the shoelaces. So we need only five rope for the shoelaces. Okay, not 12. Okay, we've crafted the entire armor. Let's drop this armor over here. A little bit of duct tape. Not duct tape, but, the, but rope, excuse me. Let's drop the rope. Why on earth did I drop everything here? I have no idea. I just kind of wanted to drop gasoline, but then I remembered that the gasoline is not here. I don't hold gasoline in this chest. Let's get some wood. 
Let's craft five hatches, probably. Uh, one, two, three, four. How do you get to level 150 fast? By doing Bunker Alpha. You do Bunker Alpha and you will get to level 150 pretty fast. On how to get rubber parts, you get them from Bunker Alpha or from whatever chest, basically. There are lots of rubber parts everywhere. You can find them, like, probably in green and red locations by opening up chests. Or Bunker Alpha. That's where you get that stuff. Okay, let's go. Let's talk to the raiders. And Kaylee Steffes, welcome to the stream. Welcome, welcome. And to those that just joined, you're just in time for our second raid. Just have to talk to the raiders. Okay, well, that's it. Let's go for our raid number. So, so far, the last, I don't know, dozen raids were kind of garbage. Maybe this raid is going to be something different. Maybe we'll get something nice during this raid. Who knows? Time will only tell. Let's go on YouTube. Let's do a little bit of research. LDOE raid player. Oh my goodness. When will these player raids stop? Um, something tells me I've raided this base in the past. I feel like it, but have I really raided it in the past? I think so. Yeah, I think that's it. We can go for the raid. That's it. That's all the research that I needed to do. But Saiki only done three second research. Well, what can I do at bases like this? I have no idea what have happened with these raids. There's a new quest up for Bunker Alpha. Said it had new changes. Uh, what? Are you talking about the calendar bunker alpha here? Or something else is going on with bunker alpha. There are new bunker alpha tasks for raiders. Maybe. I don't know. All I know is that I'm going to drop the C4 here. So yeah, there are only two chests. So let's chop them down and let's get out of this raid. One, two, three hits over here. Um, okay, 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 okay. Not that bad, not that bad. Could have been worse. At least we've gotten a little bit of armor. Would be cool if your character could keep shooting while you're looting. And checking your boxes. Or maybe you can shoot and check your boxes. I don't think so. I think your character just turns around then. So no, you cannot do that. Let's get this. Let's open up one more box. Absolutely nothing inside of the box. That's it. We can leave this place. So we've gotten two armors, a gun, and that's it. A little bit of bauxite with leather. Mm, I don't know if this base gets axe approval. I don't really know. I don't know. I don't know. I don't know. See, I'll probably run back to the base. Yeah, let's go back to the base. How do you get rubber parts? I've literally just answered this question. I don't know to whom, to you or to someone else, but you just do bunker alpha or clear whatever green or red locations. And by opening up those chests, you can find rubber parts there. Rubber parts are basically everywhere. You can get them in airdrops. During airdrops, you can get them everywhere. You can get that stuff basically everywhere. Hmm. Okay, let's drop another armor if I'm gonna find some space here. Why every chest is always full? Okay, here I, can, I have enough space for one more armor. And the other armor is gonna go here. So let's drop all the hatchets. Um, let's drop the iron, steel, the bauxite goes all the way up here. Now let's play the raiders once again with that electronic circuit.
Here we go. Let's call the writers. And have they stolen anything from the old pickup truck? Doesn't really look like it. That's it, raiders have spawned. So we need to open up three blue cards. We need to get 20 iron plates and three deals with the dealer, which I mean, all of these tasks are easy peasy. Are we gonna do a third raid today? Are we gonna do a third raid? I mean, I guess let's make a deal with a dealer though and we can go for the third raid. I didn't expect that these tasks are gonna be so easy. So let's go for the third. I mean, it's not like easy, easy, but you got the point. All of the tasks that we need to wait. So seven rope and 10 nails. Let's get that and let's go for the third raid. Rope and nails. Let's go. Let's get rope and some nails. Some rope and little bit of nails. Where am I going? Oh, for the to the dealer. I'm like, wait, why did they leave the base? It's like, what about the mannequin? Put armor there if you want. The mannequin already has some armor. The mannequin already has one uh, set of armor there. Do you have enough C4s? I have no idea. We'll need to go through the inbox and see. Maybe we have some C4s there. If we don't, we don't. We'll have to do research on the raid and see what kind of raid is that. Maybe it doesn't even require any C4s, but I don't know. We'll see. What's wrong with this dealer? Where are his pants? Why is he like that? Uh, Whatever. Let's get the box. And just as always, peeps, guess what we're going to get inside of that box. The winners get nothing. And if you're feeling like today's your day, if you woke up today and you're like, hey, I want to get nothing, then... Guess what we're going to get inside of that box. Go on, go on, go on. Who's going to win today? The dealer's chilling. Yeah, with only underwear. Of course he's chilling. Of course. Why wouldn't he chill? Okay, so that's it. That's enough guesses. As soon as I'm going to load in the game, I will open it up. All right, that's enough. Definitely took way too much time. Now, too many people participated. It's going to be hard to see. But whatever. We've gotten a machete. Eight people guessed it. Okay, so that's not that bad. Cobra Flop, Nick Restino, Slash, uh, Yalniz Panda, Ahmed, uh, Januel Sevilana, uh, Epiphany86. And uh, that's it. Those were the people that I've guessed. Maybe also Radek Gruba, but I'm not really certain. Probably. So yeah, those people that I've just mentioned, congratulations on winning absolutely nothing. The rest of you people. Congratulations. Congratulations. This is your day today. Um, so let's go for the third raid. Some people are still guessing. Guys, it's too late. That's it. It's too late. Let's craft five hatchets. What do you mean doggos and turkey little barrows? Doggos are fed. Doggos are fully fed. And you know it. Let's get that. Let's get some... Blanks and iron, perhaps? Here we go. And there I can craft five hatchets, hopefully. One, two, three, four, and five... Let's get it. Um, nails, 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 nails will go over here. The duct tape and the planks. And yeah, let's see if I have any more C4s. We should maybe have some. Let's go to weapons. 
pretty please. Yes, we still have some C4s. Nice. First time winning nothing. Nice. Congratulations oh, on winning nothing. Running kind of low on stones. So let's get to more simple hatchets and let's go for that raid. One, two. Glocks. Here we go. We have one more Glock. Don't even have to upgrade it. So let's just eat some food. Let's drink some water. Here we go. That's nice. Purple crate opening today. Yes. And I have to take another shower because I pee. No! Sick and tired of this goop. Sick and tired of it. Well, at least I'm going to take only two bottles of water. So that this way I don't uh, have to delete anything. So that this way I don't have to bring anything back to the chest. So I'll just wash myself, myself and I delete those two bottles of water. I'll wash myself and I'll go. That's it. Raiders leave. So we are ready. We are ready. Maybe the third raid is going to be fine. As they say, third time's the charm or whatever. Maybe this raid is going to be awesome. Maybe. Or maybe not. Or maybe it'll be goopy goopy raid. Hoarding all the food for himself while doggos starve. <sighs> I fed them. They are fully fed with full bellies of food. Okay, and now we're doing research. LDOE raid player. One, two, uh, three, four. Okay. Have I raided this base? Ooh! Oh, you might be like, Sayek, you're lying. Am I lying? Why would I lie? Like, explain to me. Why would I lie? This is going to be a great raid. Finally, third time's the charm. As I said, third time is going to be the great raid. I'm telling you, peeps. So I put this and uh, where, 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 where else I go? Okay, two more C4s. And I go through this place, through the top, wherever. Okay, cool, I get it. Understandable, have a nice day. I am ready. I am actually ready. Probably. Let's get back to the base though. We have to take the fish buff. I think so. Yes, yes, let's get the fish buff because this is going to be actually a pretty big raid, so I kind of need the fish buff. Um... I am out of carp. We need to go and fish today. And feed the doggos. Guys. They've, they're already fed. Okay. I've already fed them. Stop it. Stop saying nonsense. Stop guys speaking nonsense. Oh my goodness. Can you just sit on the chopper and go? Timer is ticking. Our fish buff is ticking.
I told you to go fishing. Yes, I will go fishing soon, maybe, hopefully. Say, so let's go now for the raid. We've already fed the doggers. We don't need to feed them. Uh, Zach, uh, Cypress, sorry for your name. Thank you for live streaming last night. You're the man. Thank you, mate, for being here. Welcome, welcome to the stream. Glad to see you here. Hello, hello. Hello, hello. So we're going to start going for the raid. We're going to destroy one spike trap. I will get a C4. We don't really need maybe even two C4s, but... Hey, I'll probably get them. Let's go. Let's get a 2 C4s. I'm going to drop one C4 somewhere over here. Hopefully, I place it on the right wall. Hopefully. Here we go. One thing got destroyed. Look at these silly zombies. They're going through the spike trap. They're going to die even before they come to me. That's nice. No, 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 no. no. Place a C4. Let's go. Bloater, bloater had some health. And here we're gonna get some more Glocks. You might be like, oh my god, Sarek, what is this kind of raid? Well, you will see. You will see soon enough. Is the calendar here to stay as the new update? I don't know. I don't think so. Would be cool. But I don't know. What do we get inside of this place? Four Glocks. That's it, ladies and gentlemen. That's the radium. I'd be like, Zach, you're lying! Of course I am lying. There has to be one more chest. Probably even this one, if I'm not mistaken. And just look at it, peeps. Just take a deep breath with me together. Also here, obviously, we're gonna get uh, batteries, and they're awesome. But... <sighs> took a deep breath together, and look at all of these guns. Oh my goodness, I... Wow! I know. I know, this is a sick raid. This is indeed a sick raid. Alrighty, so let's bring the guns to the chopper. Maybe I'm even gonna die on the spike traps here right now. Yeah, 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 probably. That's what we're gonna do. That would be a smart thing to do. So let's quickly die on the spike traps. Which is... That's not it. I'm pretty certain... Oh no, maybe that's it. I know. Uh, we'll see. Let's die on the spike traps. Can you please die faster? Here, go dead. But Saik, why would you do something like that? Because it's necessary. It is absolutely necessary. And I don't really know which other chest we have to open up there, but we'll see. base is gonna disappear. Somebody said it shouldn't disappear. It shouldn't. Unless I've done something wrong, then yes, it might disappear, but it shouldn't disappear. Somebody said base is gone. Why would it be gone? Why are you guys saying that it's gone? It shouldn't be gone. It can't be gone. I haven't done any mistakes. Nothing. It still should be there. But you are scaring me a bit. With that base is gone. See, peeps, it's still there. What do you mean it's gone? It's still there. <sighs> I kind of got scared for a second. But if I travel now, let's say, to this pine grove, it will disappear. Say, so let's get back to the base. It has 100 turkey inside. I don't really know which chest to open up. It's like, why don't you craft assault armor? Well, why don't you craft it? Because, Sayak, I don't know. It's not in the game. Exactly. So how can I craft it if it's not in the game? I don't know, Sayak. I'm sorry for asking silly questions. It's fine. You're forgiven. Let's take the rest of the armor. Let's get the guns. And let's get back to looting that base. But before we do this, I want to loot the old pickup truck. Nothing here. 
nothing, nothing useful in the pickup truck. Where are the guns? Where are the guns? Three Glocks only left there. I thought we'd get more. But hey. Oh, over there we can get a shotgun. Check this out. Another shotty. Not really certain if we can get anything in this chest. I mean, I might as well just open it up. I am already here. I've gotten absolutely nothing. Let's get back to the chopper. Let's fill the chopper up with these items. And then let's open up the rest of the chests. Take some batteries. We have a lot of batteries at the base. I'm not taking more batteries. I have already a lot of batteries. More than I can use. Don't really have space for batteries now. Yeah, I want to fill up the chopper with the Glocks. So yeah, I think it's time to open up the chest then. Oh, let's go. Let's start smacking this chest down in the corner. Maybe I should open a bigger chest first before opening up these smaller ones. But here we can get balls there. Anything else here? Nope, just scrap metal. Um, Gold bars. Oh my god, take like gold! Take it, take it! There's nothing to do with the gold. Stop it. You can give it to the dealer sometimes, occasionally, when he wants it. And a bunch of rubber parts. I think I'll open up this chest and the rest will probably soften them up. One, two hits. One, two. One, two. <laughs> and you cannot kill the big one on spikes before somebody says that. Maybe someone already said that in the chat, but you cannot kill the big one with, on the spike traps. Here, I think I softened all of these chests. And that's it. Let's start opening that stuff up, I guess. Okay, bunch of those heat sensors, which are kind of all right. We c you can recycle them. You can recycle that stuff. Bunch of tickets. Oh my god, psych, take them! I don't need them, thank you very much. But say that's millions of guns! You can come and take them. I left that stuff for you. If I die, I'll be a bit sad. Just a little bit. Not too much. A little bit of duct tape, which is kind of cool, but I, I don't need this. Okay, heal. Heal! Schmuck! Okay, nothing there. Okay, dude, 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 dude. Just heal up again. And nothing useful there. And the electronic circuit, but I don't need it. That's it. There's nothing else in this raid. So this base. Get Sykes approval. A really nice raid. A bunch of Glocks. Amazing. Nothing else that I could hope for. Recycle heat sensors 4 for steel. So that's it. I got the red ticket. That's it. That's all I got and I didn't need anything else. So the raid is awesome. I wouldn't give it a 10 out of 10. I'd say like it's an 8, 7 out of 10 raid. 7, 8 out of 10 raid. It's a, it's a good raid. But we still have so many of these heat sensors. Like they don't even fit. I've taken them, but for what reason? Pointless. Absolutely pointless. Oh, maybe I can store more heat sensors here in this chest. Um, I'll get the guns from the chopper. Where did I put the Glocks? I don't remember. 
Okay, here perhaps if they fit. Okay, they do fit almost. Almost. I'm gonna drop the hatchets up the top, then it'll give raiders some spears. So yeah, I took the right ticket. Those other tickets were useless. We already have enough of green and orange. I mean, we could maybe take some, but it's fine. It's not a big, of, it's not big of a deal. Uh, let's give them some modded spears. Okay, so he didn't take. They did not take those three spears. Um, what if I give them more? That was a pretty good raid, so yeah, sometimes they don't take one spear. Most of the time they take one spear, but sometimes they don't. Maybe this time we'll have to give them electronic circuits. They do not take spears at all. Like, check this out. I gave them an entire inventory of spears. They do not want it. Usually they take it, but sometimes they don't. Say, so let's give them the floppy disks as always. Give them a poppy. Actually, we could do this. Check this out. We have a few elite corgis. But it's like it's an elite corgi. I mean, I could let it out. Tucker. More like... Uh, Gooper. Am I right? Let's go, Gooper. Go to the doggo crate. Maybe I'm not gonna give them elite corgis. Toby. More like Gooper. Yo, Imad Larosi. Thank you for the super chat. Welcome to the stream. Welcome, welcome. Where are the doggo? Shepherd poppies. Check this out. We're gonna give the elite poppy. Maybe they'll want it. They still do not want it. Hmm. So, uh, yeah, I'll, I'm just gonna give them electronic circuits. Still not enough? Wow! 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 Whoa! That is insane! Let's get this! Sometimes it does happen. Sometimes it does happen. Let's try to give them two electronic circuits. Three. Four. Wow! Four. Five. Six. Seven. Eight. Nine. Well, it's... Nine. Ten. What if I get rid of the spears? Give them a stack of electronic circuit. That is actually nice. Wait, we've got a bunch of electronic circuits, so I'll try to give them that stuff. Uh, heat sensors, not electronic circuits. Not bad, you can do it when you want it. Okay, so take this stack of heat sensors and this. And obviously spears, I don't want them here. Take that puppy with you. Take the garbage from me. Let's go, let's call them on the radio. Let's drop the rest of those electronic circuits in the chest. Sheesh, well, at least the raid was worth it. So we could, we paid them, but yeah, at least the raid was worth it. Here, the raiders took everything and now they're back. Mm, where we could, what could we do now? There are lots of things where we could go for. I want to go to the dead island to get some titanium, but I'm not certain about it. Uh, wait, I'd love to go outside real quick because I still need to do some... Maybe I'm gonna start doing the tasks. Yes, that's it. I know what we're gonna do. We're gonna progress. And that in those tasks, whatever they're called in the Lunar New Year tasks. Yes, let's go for it. And go fishing. Yes, we also gotta go fishing because I'm out of carp. That is true. 
If there's a fishing event, there there has to be a fishing event there. Let's get some burly. Only one burly. Uh, we're gonna get a grenade, maybe. Um, at least one nade. Maybe we're gonna go to the dead island right now. Yeah, we should go to the dead island right now. That's what I'll do. We'll go to the dead island and then we'll come back. Let's get a few saw blade maces. Let's upgrade all of these weapons. And yeah, I'm ready. Alright, there's a lot of juicy steaks that we had to eat in order to replenish our thirst. Should have just popped the beans. As I don't really like taking beans with me on the road. If I take any food with me, those are usually gonna be carrots or steaks. I don't usually take beans because beans produce waste. They produce those empty cans. So my inventory gets more cluttered. So I usually prefer to eat beans at the base. Yeah, that's it. I've kind of upgraded everything. Yeah, let's go now. Yeah, I've gotten everything. Let's go. Let's, let's go. Did I take grenades? I said that I'll take at least one grenade, and apparently I did not. I, take, I took zero nades. Uh, so let's take at least one grenade then. At least one. Well, hopefully one is gonna be enough. Can you bring Doggo to the dead island? I'm pretty certain Doggo could follow you to the dead island, but the problem is that I don't have any food to give to Doggo, so that's pretty sad. But if I had, I'd definitely take the true friend Doggo with me to the dead island. What does the treadmill do? Nothing. Treadmill does absolutely nothing. Where's the fishing event? Here we go. There's the fishing spot. Let's go. Let's drive there. Let's go. Let's go. Let's go. Let's go. Why do you need a grenade for fishing? Because we're going to fish. Um, I'm pretty certain fishing rods are in the weapon section. Here we go. Let's take one more fishing rod and let's fish here a bit. You can feed them anytime. I... We, you can feed them whenever you want, but I don't have food for them. I do not have any food left for doggos. That's the sad part. I don't have any food left. Okay, we can also get a grenade if we give him that silver quality catfish. Maybe I shouldn't be wasting this fishing rod, but whatever. Okay, let's get the first fish. So yeah, the reason why I came here is for carps. I don't know if you can get any carps in this location. Maybe. Maybe yes, maybe no. I have no idea. Oh my goodness, look at this fish. Just flying everywhere. Yo, call back! I sent a complaint to PETA. Kyrick is not feeding his dogs. <sighs> Thank you, mate, for the super chat. Welcome to the stream. I fed my doggos. How many times I have to say this? I already fed them and I don't have any more food left. I've done everything I could. I'm a good boy. I gave food to doggos already. I don't want to overfeed them. Overfeeding isn't bad. It is, isn't good. Obesity is not healthy, so I take care of my doggos. In the game. So yeah. Here we go, we've gotten a chest. 
And here we've gotten another perch. Will I get any carps, please? At least one or two carps. Oh, we've also gotten a surgeon card. Another perch. And that's it. Okay. We gotta use the burly then. Eat my children. Let's use a grenade. Maybe you can't even get here any carps. Oof. Trout, salmon, and pikes. Nothing. Absolutely nothing. Legit, besides true friend, uh, Popper, the rest just stuck in the crate, lol. Game is cruel, not Cyrex, the scaly Stefan. Exactly! Why on earth you can only take true friend Doggo with you, but the rest of the Doggos are stuck in the crate? Hmm? Not my fault. Absolutely not my fault. I'm doing what I can. But I, I'm out of food, peeps. I'm legitimately out of food. I can show you all the chests. They don't eat carrots. I can give them carrots. Do they eat carrots? Sadly, no. In real life, dogs eat carrots. But in this game, they don't. It's not my bad. It's not my fault that they don't eat carrots. You get floppy crate by exchanging notebooks in the inbox. Do we have a lot of notebooks? I haven't even paid attention. We have only 18 notebooks. I don't think that's gonna be enough for the floppy crate. But hey, if ever we go for the, if I ever go for the floppy crate, we will go there. So, yeah. Let's go, let's go. And yo, call butt! Thank you for the super chat. This should make their belly full. Don't forget, he can also roll on his back per Lila's request. But heck, it's Lila. Of course, of course. Of course, of course. This should make their belly full. Don't forget, he can roll on his back per Lila's request. You see, the bot even agrees that it's Lila. Per Lila's request. Okay, so I'm gonna feed the doggos then. If I'm gonna find some food. All right, I'll, I'll search for a little bit of food. Okay, I have 12 steaks, but hear me out. I have a family to feed. Sayak, stop! I have a family to feed. So I'm gonna give uh, half of my steaks for the family, right? Then I have to eat myself a bit. Here we go. I'm feeling a bit better. That's it. There's only one steak left for them. But Sayak! Here we go, one steak. That's enough. Four minutes and 47 seconds. Look. Where's the food? Where's the food? There is no food. <laughs> Look at the doggo. <laughs> Searching for food, but there is no food. Look at this, he's just licking empty plate. Look at them! They're both licking an empty plate! That is awesome. That is awesome. That's not awesome, I don't know what is awesome. They just licked an empty plate. Alright, I'll give them some more steaks. Some more turkeys. But that's my winter supply, all right? I get, I'm gonna give them a stack. I'm gonna give them a stack of food. All right? Stack of turkeys. Here we go. For eight hours! Look at this crate! If that's not enough, I don't know what's enough. Look at the crate of food here. Look at them eating. I overfed them. 47 food bags. What do you mean 47 dog food bags? What can I do with those dog food bags? Where are they? In the crate there? That's again for the winter supply. <laughs> he ate the meat equivalent of the whole family. Well, it do be like that. Let's go. I'm gonna give them stack of doggo food. Is that enough? Is that enough, peeps? Stack of doggo food. How much more doggo food can I give? Here I got 16 hours of doggo food. How much more can I give that stuff? For 16 hours. They have enough food for for days now. That's it. I've done my part here. I have done my part. I was supposed to open up five purple cars today, but now I'll open up zero. That's it. That's it. As I said, guys, it all depends on my mood. And you forced me to give my all supplies. For the doggos. It's not how it works. That's it. 
<laughs> no, I'm kidding, peeps. I don't even probably have enough blue cards to open up five purple. But I fed the doggos, right? I, I fed the doggos enough. Haven't I? Uh, what else did I want to do? I don't remember the titanium drill, bro. That's where we are going. Where's the titanium drill? But Cyric, what do you need a titanium drill for? We're going to drill in the caves. Let's go. So is that enough food? I gave them enough food for 16 hours. 16 hours! They have food for 26 days. Like, no, 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 they don't have food for 26 days. They have food for 16 hours, but the effect of this stuff will last for 25 days. For 26 days, almost. How many puppies do you have? I don't have a lot of them. I have no idea, but more than one, that's for sure. <laughs> I have no idea how many we have. How many puppies do I have? Honestly, oh, these locations are reset. Okay, so I gotta go there, but before we do this, I wanna go to the dead island real quick and get some titanium real quick. Can you cook rice on your base? I have no idea. I haven't tried. I doubt it. Doggo ran it to give you kisses and good luck. Yeah, yeah, they, he just did that because I fed them and that's it. Check this out, the doggos, they can roll. Holy moly, wow! Oops. He's gone, doggos can roll, doggos can bark. Amazing. Amazing, mind blown. Um, what I'd love to do is get some more cement, but I don't have enough stones. Even in the inbox, I have only seven stones left there, so that's it. I cannot get, get more cement right now, at least. Doggo's good luck, that means you're gonna die in the dead island. If I die in the dead island, that's it, that's gonna be a sign that Doggo's are cursed. If I die here right now, I'll never feed them again. Do we have a deal? But psych! That's it, you shook the hand, you don't have the right to back track from the deal. That's it. That's it. If I die here in the dead island, I'm never feeding them again. Oh, let's get the AK, the Glocks. All right, let's deal with the Stormtrooper. I'll be very sad if I die in the Dead Island. I didn't mean to get that orange ticket. I don't want it. I don't want that orange ticket. Here, let's get the groaner. Let's take off our armor. But Cyric, why? Because... There are a lot of zombies, they don't do that much damage, so it's better to take off your armor. Aren't you cursed too though, Cyric? I mean, being able to revive yourself is some next level shiz. I agree! This game is mysterious. What if last on Earth is all just a dream? Every time you die... Uh, your dream just restarts. 
Hmm. Yeah, I won't be able to sneak behind the lurker. Let's get the... The katana. Let's deal with another pale zombie. And look at this. Now Doggo's gonna steal points from the lurker. How is that possible? I mean, how is that legal? Excuse me, check this out. Doggo will steal the kill and I won't get any points towards the season pass. It's like, why you don't feed Doggo's? That's why, because he's gonna steal the points. Here, go, got him. Got 150 points. Pretty dope, if you ask me. Hey, let's drill over here. Titanium. More titanium. And yeah, I'll probably use the C-Force just so that it's a bit faster to get more titanium rather than just drilling all the time. Thank you. I'm sorry. I apologize, ladies and gentlemen. I think I even sneezed out a piece of my brain. That was good. But it's like, you don't have a brain, ha ha ha. You're very funny. You're very hilarious. Super funny. Let's skedaddle from here. Bless you. Thank you, guys. Thank you. Thank you, thank you. <laughs> thank you, thank you. Uh, let's pop the Stormtrooper. The titanium fragment armor suit piece. Is there the bear? We could kill the bear just for the sake of points. Unless Doggo's gonna steal the points. Which everything is possible. Everything's possible, but hey, I'm gonna kill the bear here. Doggo, do not dare steal my points. I'll drop kick you. No, I got 150 points. That's nice. Okay, let's restore our health here. Beautiful. Beautiful, 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 beautiful. Let's get the katana. Here I can take off the armor again. Oops. Oops, they saw me. They have noticed me. So let's quickly drill some more titanium. Why no armor? Because there is a lot of there are a lot of zombies. Like they don't do that much damage, so it's better to take off your armor. As they'll damage your armor too much. Okay, we got this guy. Let's drill this place. A titanium or another katana. Because check this out, peeps. Look at it. There are many zombies. Right? And look at that. They're not doing they're doing a lot of damage, kinda. But yeah. They would be shredding your armor here so quickly. Your armor would just disappear here. You'd need to bring three, four armors, which I should maybe bring more armors as I do have a lot of armors at the base. But it just depends what you have more armors or first aid kits. Um, let's go to weapons. Imagine VSS guy spawns here and kills you. I don't even know if it's possible for VSS to, uh, VSS guys to spawn here. Probably not. Hopefully not. Here, the thing exploded. I've gotten more resources, so we are already at a stack of titanium. Just kind of cool. Here, I got my equipping the armor to leave this place. I'll probably do one more cave, and that's it. Then we can... Then we're done. I think two stacks of titanium ores is going to be enough. I think. I think, I think.
Don't try to keep your eyes open while sneezing. Now I'm getting tips and tricks on how to sneeze. Thank you. Thank you for the tips and tricks on how to sneeze. Thank you. Thank you, thank you. I'll make sure to close my eyes next time I sneeze. Keep your eyes keep your eyes closed while sneezing. Alright, boomer. How to sneeze efficiently. Tutorial. Okay. Well, I didn't die by clearing last dead island, so will I die now? Everything's possible. It's like your doggo is tired. What can I do with that piece? I did not take any doggo treats. I don't have any doggo treats. Let the doggo rest. Why do you want to bully doggo? Why do you always want him to bite and fight and work? Let him rest. You monsters. Doggo is resting, catching his breath, and you're like, Psyche, he's tired. Go on, push him. Make him work. Monsters. And then I'm the monster here. Okay, let's deal with this. Um, um. Okay, let's deal with the pale schmuck. I mostly take off my armor for... Oops. I mostly take off my armor for this place. Let's check this out. There are three zombies. They are damaging your armor. So that's why I take it off. Where's the silly pale zombie? Okay, well, let's deal with him first and then let's deal with the lurker. Check this out. Lurker does only six damage. But he would be chipping away on your armor little by little. Lurker is dead. I've gotten 150 extra points. Your body won't let you keep your eyes open when you sneeze. Uh, one a bit. So like, like. <laughs> I have no idea. I never experienced that. Never tried to play with my eyes. If they stay open or they stay closed while I'm sneezing. But I, I'm going to believe that. Let's say I believe you. Cool, let's drop another C4. Why don't I just take out two or four C4s at the same time? Just in case if I die, at least I don't want to lose those other C4s. So yes, I think about the possibility of me dying here. If you keep your eyes open while sneezing, your eyes will come out. Again, I'm not a doctor. I have no idea. But it also depends how you sneeze. Some people sneeze and they close their nose. Like, usually you do that if you want to be very quiet, if you don't want anyone to hear you. But it's kind of painful. It's kind of useless, I think. It's kind of not satisfying. What are we going to talk about sneezing now? How you're supposed to sneeze? You guys can sneeze how you want. You have my approval to sneeze how you want. I allow you. Let's get the saw blade mace. All right, let's deal with the pale zamzams. Let's drill a bit more. Let's 
outside, goes to the kitchen for Pepper to conduct sneeze experiment. Um, I don't have Pepper. Like, what kind of kitchen do you have? You don't have Pepper. Huh? I have Pepper. That was just a joke, guys. Have you ever heard of jokes? I totally have Pepper. Yeah, I have Pepper, guys. For sure. I am normal. I have Pepper. Yeah. Please believe me. I for real have pepper. I have nothing to prove to you peeps. I have pepper. Believe it or not, but I have pepper. Let's drop one more C4. Some people sneeze when they see the sun. Instead of gotten more titanium, so we have gotten another stack of it. So we have one more stack already in the boat. That's it, we can leave this place. Will you solve Rubik's Cube at the end though? Hmm, as Janual uh, Sevelina, sorry for butchering the name, maybe there will be a Rubik's Cube solve at the end. Maybe, maybe. There's nothing really much to show there, I haven't improved much, I haven't solved many Rubik's Cubes. There are still lots of things for me to improve, but hey, I have the Rubik's Cube. I have the Rubik's Cube. It's like we're sick and tired of your Rubik's Cube. This is only the first time when I mentioned the Rubik's Cube because some of you guys in the chat asked about the Rubik's Cube. So I had to tell, talk to you about the Rubik's Cube. That's it. Let's get everything. It's like you should just peel off the stick, the the color stickers from the Rubik's cube and place them correctly. Yes, that's another way to solve the Rubik's cube. Yes. Sadly, I don't have the stickers on the Rubik's cube, but that's a good, a good, good tip and trick. What's your best time? I think I had like 40, 50 seconds best time. That was long ago, like two years ago. But uh, that was very lucky solve and that's it. But I would say my average is around two minutes. So there's still, as I said, a lot to learn. Oops, didn't mean to switch to the character. Let's get back to the base. Did you see the next weekend rush? Yes, the one for the police department. Yes, indeed. Here we go, we've gotten some titanium, nice. Titanium, titanium, huh? Let's get some more coal real quick. Not PD Bunker Alpha. I don't even know what I've said there. I don't remember. You solve Rubik's Cube uh, the same as playing chess. Yeah, I'm, I'm as good as at Rubik's Cube as I'm at with chess. I agree. And I am a grandmaster.
Whatever, let's drop the manual earth drill probably somewhere here. And finally, let's go to the to those new events. Let's go and let's do the daily task. Maybe we're gonna fight Neom a couple of times even today, mayhaps. I don't really need that many melee weapons, do I? Let's get the Glock. Let's get a few shotties. An AK or two, and that should be enough. Yeah, I think I'm ready. I think I've taken everything. I'm just double, triple checking, but yeah, I think I've taken everything. So yeah, let's go. Torch, one hatchet, and five raw meat, 20 carrots, and 20 seeds for tasks. Here we go. Here goes my readiness. Let's get five meat. Yeah, yeah, let's get some meat. Let's get 20 carrots, stack of seeds, and I actually have probably seeds in the inbox, so I'm going to be fine with that. And a torch. Torch is worth it. If I have a torch, but I probably don't. No, I do have a torch, so let's go. I fought him once and then fed him more and he doesn't come again. He's scared. You need to feed him a lot. You need to feed him a lot, a lot, a lot, a lot for him to come. I am a bit lost. Let's go to the silent abode. Probably. No, 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 no. Not the silent abode. No! Didn't mean to go back to the base. I wanted to go somewhere else. I wanted to go to the other location, not to the silent abode. Yo, just mean welcome to the stream. Welcome, welcome. Hello, hello. Hello, hello. All of the resources are in our inbox, says Lost Marangus. Yes, all of the resources are in our inbox. Indeed. Our inbox. <laughs> That's it, we're back here. Yo, welcome, dealer. Let's hit the gong. Let's get the shotgun. Obviously, we gotta talk to her first before we hit the gong, but we also need to go and talk to the guy up there. Um, let's talk to the lonely elder. The horse requires care. Feed it with carrots. It loves that treat. Light up lanterns, and we've noticed our Arcata zombies in the pine groves. Okay, we gotta deal with all of those schmucks. Let's go, let's feed the dog, uh, the horse. I've given him stack of, stack of, stack of, stack of loot. Now let's light up the lanterns. Here go, there's the third lantern. There still have to be two more lanterns. Hmm. One more. There's gotta be one more lantern somewhere. I have no idea where though. Oh, uh, hello? 
It's like you missed it, it's down there. I'll find it, peeps. No worries, here go, there's the lantern. We did it. We did it. Okay, here we go. Let's grow some more rice. Oh, I'm probably just gonna delete this. And yeah, that's it. Now we can hit the gong. Let's kill Jenkshi. Okay, so those are just terracotta zombies. Don't even want to fight them, but I probably gotta kill them. Okay, there's the Jenkshi. Got him. Another Jenkshi. Got him. Got him. I'll just keep running around in circles, and then I'll just spread shot all of them, because why not? Got four of them. They do not spawn! Okay, five of them. So you have to kill all of them, basically, or you'll just get swarmed. But yeah, shotgun is the best for this event. Okay, terracotta zombie, another terracotta zombie. Um, a spread shot. Dude, where's the other zombie? Check this out, there are no Jing Jing Shi zombie. That's it, got him. There were only 20 seconds left, but they they could uh, they didn't spawn. They did not spawn. They didn't start spawning. That did not start sp spawning. Uh, Malkara Prime, thank you for the super chat. Uh, why are there zombies in the laboratory not dying? Why are the zombies in the laboratory not dying? There are a few possible solutions. There are a few possible cases. First of all, you are probably doing hard mode laboratory. If you activate hard mode, then, then you need armor piercing weapons. But if you haven't activated hard mode laboratory, then most likely you've gotten... Uh, there's a cocoon and then zombies don't die. You need to explode the cocoon first before those zombies die. But it's usually in the middle of the laboratory on the first floor only. And I don't know about other cases why they wouldn't die. Okay, hopefully that answers the question. Let's read the prophecy. Probably I'll read that prophecy after all of the tasks are done. Let's give six bowls of rice. Let's grow some more rice. Okay, let's go to the map. Let's do the test there. Hi, Psych. Today you are sorry and I forgive you, says Hyder. What is that supposed to mean? What on earth is that supposed to mean? Let's go to the pine grove to kill the terracotta zombies. Take off... Uh, take lots of armor. Stupid acid spear destroyed so much of my clothing. Uh, maybe. Maybe, maybe, maybe. You're wasting rice, bro. <laughs> then come and take it! Come and take my rice! Actually, I love rice. In real life. In real life. Rice is such a simple thing, but... Rice with that Maggie sauce that I already spoke about, it's like... My favorite food. It's pretty simple. But what can I say? I'm a simple man. The cold Lila mod- suggested the minigun. What do you think? I was adjusted the minigun for for the for the uh, cool one. Thank you for the super chat. <laughs> minigun is good everywhere. Well, besides bunker, Bravo, and some other places, but for the whatever the place is called, Gong for the arena might work. Probably I haven't used the minigun in the Gong arena, but I think minigun might work there. It's pretty fast. It might work definitely. I mean, to be honest, a lot of guns are gonna work there. If minigun works, then AK is gonna work, then Glock is gonna work. But yeah, a lot of weapons are gonna work there. Yeah, minigun is gonna work. 
Yes, indeed. So, yeah, I do agree with that. Oh, no. Alpha, Wolfo. Got all of them. Let's skedaddle from this place. I thought the deer's gonna attack me. But that's a deer. It's like loves rice and pasta. I love rice. I wouldn't say that I love pasta. I would give pasta like... If I have to give rice with that sauce, I'd give that 9 out of 10, right? As food. 9 out of 10. As the side dish. Is it a side dish? You know what I mean, like potatoes, pasta, uh, whatever else. You got the point. It'd give rice a 9 out of 10. Pasta, depends on which kind of pasta. But pasta can be like a 7 maybe. Maybe an 8 out of 10, 7. But it's not higher than that. So I came back here to the base to quickly get new armor because I'm out of armor. Would you try Dead by Daylight just for one time? Please, please, please. I've already actually played it. Exception Thinker. I've already played Dead by Daylight probably once, if I'm not mistaken. Unless I'm mistaken. Here, let's get a new prophecy. We'll have to go to the pine bush, as it said. And where's the new armor? Let's get back on the chopper. It's like Neon level 100 is insane. You cannot get to level 100, Neon. Stop it. Let's get back to the silent abode. Rice is cool, you can do so much with it. Well, I don't know any things that I can do with rice, as I said, besides just cooking it and putting sauce on it, and that's it. That's all I know about rice. But it tastes great. Okay, let's try to leave the... I cannot leave the bike! Schmuck! Is there anything that you can do well? Uh, Rubik's Cube? I can solve a Rubik's Cube. Excuse me, please. I won't make it on the bike there. Shut your mouth. Here we go. That's much better. Where is the cocoon? I'm doing it on easy mode, says Malkara Prime. Uh, it's gonna be hard to explain. It's... If you... Depends where are those zombies. On the first floor in the beginning, you can't kill them. Just run straight and you'll see that big cocoon. Just keep going forward and you'll see that cocoon if it's there. If it's... If that's what... If that's the debuff on the first floor. An A sector. A1 sector in laboratory. If you're doing A1 sector in laboratory, only there you can find that cocoon. Probably if you have that special debuff. Before you start it, there's the terminal. You can click on the terminal and you can click on the question mark. You click on that question mark and it will say if the first floor has special enemies. And then... There will be that cocoon, like in the middle of the first floor. But if zombies don't die in the very beginning, you just enter the A1 sector and zombies don't die there, then I have no idea why they don't die. Hopefully I explained it well. But probably it's not because of the cocoon. Maybe there is like some sort of a glitch going on. I have no idea. Maybe or maybe it's not that. Maybe. But yeah, those are the two only cases of how I know when zombies don't die. I think. Well, yeah, hopefully I explained it correctly. Alright, I need a torch here, but I do not have a torch. I do not have a torch. I need wood. I need, I need wood. Let's start it. Um, we gotta find a chest and obviously that chest is gonna have... A oh, I did take a torch with me. I'm, an, I'm a donut. Check this out, peeps. Here, I'm like a rebel setting stuff on fire. 
these deer. You could maybe spread shot them or kill them with guns real quick for their leather. Maybe. And yeah, speaking of those zombies, they don't die in the laboratory. Those are the two only cases of how I know they wouldn't die. Either in hard mode laboratory, then you need better guns. Or there's just a cocoon on the first floor and there are like five maybe zombies around that cocoon that don't die. But other than that, I've never encountered zombies not dying in the laboratory. Okay, did you see this? Terracotta zombie was just able to... ...run around that fence. So I have to light up more bonfires around this place. Let's go. Where does one go? Excuse me. Excuse me, mister. Mr. Twister. No, that's not where I gotta go. This place is always a maze. Every time it's different. How do I get to the other side? Why he just doesn't want to jump through this fence? Why? Why not? But Cyric... Give me a good explanation why he wouldn't just jump through the fence. Like, this fence is not even a fence. Look at it. Look at it. It's knee high. It's knee high. He, he doesn't even have to jump. He just has to pick up his leg. That's it. He can walk over it as there's no tomorrow. Why does he... We will find the place. It's not like it's bad. I don't have the problem of running around and doing it, but I'm just saying that it makes no sense. Oh, here we go. There's the bridge. Pog. Now we are on another side. Oops. Didn't mean to waste that first aid kit. Alright, let's deal with the floater bloater. Let's light up the last fire here. That's it, done. We are done with the tasks, finally. Finally. Speak to Maypai. Okay. I'm surprised you've made it. <laughs> okay. I'd say that I'm surprised as well. What did I get? Three juices. Steaks, thank you very much. That's it, you've cleared this entire place and you get no special items to give to Nian. That's weird. So yeah, probably without auto-clearing it, there is no way... You can get to the maximum level. There's no way you can reach level 14 Nian. Because currently we're like, what, level 9 there or something? No, we are level 10. How on earth are you supposed to reach level 14 without auto-clearing it? I don't know if that's possible. Here, let's get some of those boxes. We will auto-clear it maybe five, six, seven, eight times. We'll see. Here we go, that's enough. Let's head back there. See, it is impossible. There's only like, what, 12, 11 days left. So there's no way to get... There's a chest. I'm, didn't I open up one more chest? I said I'm not going back to that location. Um, more rice. I can't even grow that much of the rice. Let's go. Let's give these uh, oranges. Two secret compartment boxes. Anything useful in them? Carrots, bandages, oh, candies, more candies, and some goop. I don't even know what. Let's get more of these compartments. SC4! 
Ooh. I think it's the first time when I've gotten a C4 here. Let's go, let's give these two candies. That said, prepare for the battle. The dude's gonna spawn. Let's get the guns. That's gonna be level 10 Neon. Here we gotta get the torch, but probably doesn't matter as wave of zombies are gonna spawn every time we activate the torches. So it doesn't even matter. Okay, so this Neon is pretty strong. You'll have to use some guns on him. But yeah, don't activate the flare the torches because zombies will spawn. Okay, Neon is done. Goodbye, Neon. Goodbye. Now we could activate this. Check this out. Oh no, it doesn't work. I cannot activate it. No! Well, it doesn't matter. Whatever. What we're gonna get inside of the chest? 50 caps. A doggo. Uh, fragments and some eye and some glass. Uh, final frontier pack. All right. Mm. Let's go to calendar, lunar new year. And so we are at 11 out of 14 tasks, so we still need to do two more tasks. Or maybe it's possible, I just don't grow enough rice and that's it. Here, gotta add more of that stuff. Yeah, maybe you can just grow more rice and that's it. To replace the popper you gave away. What do you mean? Oh yeah, true, the one for the raiders. I was like, wait, wait, where did they, when did I give away something? But I gave them an elite puppy. This is just a simple pop. Okay, that's it. We can leave this place. Probably no. There's one more thing that I haven't done yet. I haven't looted that chest. Let's get this prophecy. What did I get inside of the box? More water. Huh. <sighs> Thank you. Okay, that's a lot of rice that we've grown. Okay, that's it. Time for us to leave this place then. Don't really get decent rewards from Nia and Saskali. Yes, but I've heard that on level 14 you get a purple card. So I guess that's pretty cool. I think all of the efforts for the purple card are probably worth it. We can run around the rock next to the offering table when fighting Neon not to get damaged, says Logan Miller. Thank you for the info. I will definitely check it out next time. Thank you for the info. Sounds like a good tip and trick. Thank you. Thank you. So we have to find the basement here. Here go, there's the basement. <laughs> Excuse me, people. Excuse me. Right, go away, there's more than... Whatever, we're gonna leave this place. As every time probably we open up the door now, during this event, during this case, there will be lots of zombies. And it's pointless to fight them, I'll just waste the gun, so we're not gonna do that. Pointless, 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 very, very pointless. 
You know what's not pointless is purple card opening. You might be like, oh my god, it's like, no way, will you really open up a purple card now? Yes! Yes! Purple card opening. Right now. You might not believe me, but... There will be a purple card opening. You might think I'm lying, you might think I'm crazy. But we will open up a purple card. We're gonna go right to the police department. I'm just gonna drop all the loot and we will open up a purple card. Um, let's drop the guns. Um, this... Here you go, there's the puppy. Let's let it out. Casey. Okay, Casey. Go to the doggo crate. It's even rude to say this. Go to the dog crate and stay there forever. All right. Let's drop the glass, the duct tape, and three titanium fragment suit pieces. Hey, Telepathic Donut here, and damn, I'm loving Dying Light 2 series, and the Minecrafter. Thank you for watching the Dying Light 2 series, I'm glad that you're enjoying them. I am loving them as well. It's an awesome game. Um, we have to replenish the workbenches while we're here. Let's go, let's get some more ash logs. Let's start cutting them into planks. Let's also replenish this thing. Okay, we are almost out of sand then. Hmm. And also, another thing, peeps, please remind me to go to the police, uh, to the... Uh, whatever the place is called, I forgot, let me think a minute. Cyric! It's, uh... Port location, thank you guys for reminding me, it's the port location. Remind me to go to the port location to get... With the stones to get more cement, because I'm kind of running low on cement now. Do you understand me? What I say? Cement port. Yes, yes, guys. Remind me about the cement. Yes, because I'm kind of running low on cement. Hey, Sag, don't forget to go to the port for cement. Thank you, guys. You're hilarious. Very funny. Very funny. Hilarious. Extremely hilarious. Let's open up that purple card now. We're gonna get 14 blue. 14 blue, Cyric? Really? You will do this for us? Yes. 14 blue. Let's go, baby. Um, let's get rid of this armor. The machete. No, 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 no. The armor goes there. Here we go. The armor fits kinda beautiful. Let's get rid of this. Craft an electronic circuit. Why would I craft an electronic circuit? Stop it. Don't even say things like this. Stop it. When did you become Boy Scout Cyric? During season 19, we've gotten the Boy Scout's armor. And now I'm Boy Scout Cyric. Uh, where are... Here goes the gasolinium. Here goes chopper is filled up. What is the cheapest way to clean the laboratory, asked Luis Fernando. Uh, to not clean the laboratory at all. <laughs> Welcome to my Cyric Talk. If you need more tips and tricks, let me know in the chat down below. Uh, let's go to the Blackport PD. 
Yes, that's where we gotta go. Let's go. The cheapest way to clear it is with wall check and with fists. So let's open up, guys, the purple card. Let's go. The first purple, and I'll maybe open it up last uh, the in in the last spot because I usually open it up either in the first spot or in the second or in the third. So this time it'll go in the last spot. Bam, bam. Let's go. Let's see what kind of goodies we're gonna get here. We've gotten a Winchester. That's a nice start to the crate opening. A double muzzle break for for the Glock. Another Winchester. Yikes. The reinforced stock to the Uzi. Another flare gun to, and the big uh, ammo to the shotgun. Uh, double drum magazine for the SCAR. And drum roll, please. I've gotten here Uzi sight times four. I don't have this mod, though. I don't have it. Look at it. I didn't have this mod. Maybe I can improve my Uzi now. Maybe this sight times four mod is better. Hmm, maybe it's all right. Okay, you know what? All right, purple crate opening. I didn't have it. I didn't even know that mod exists, but hey, at least it's something that I don't have, right? At least it's something. Hey, flare gun is awesome. Yes, very awesome. Of course. I'd rather get a flare gun instead of an AK or a Glock or whatever else. Of course. Mm, let's get the rest of this armor. Shoddy. Some more guns. And more armor. Let's go, let's drop that stuff in the chopper, and then let's come back for more crates. Sight times four is the best mod. Maybe, maybe I'll have to get back to the base. Maybe we're even gonna assemble that mod then. Let's go. Better than a Winchester. It is better than a Winchester. I agree, a flare gun is better than a Winchester. I mean, it's hard to not be better than a Winchester. Zipgun is better than a Winchester, probably. That's it. We have done the purple card opening. Now let's go. Let's craft that... That that thing. Let's run back home. The site times four is better than the Kilimanator site. Maybe. I have no idea about the all the mods by heart. I don't know all of them. I haven't memorized all the mods there. Sound like I go before bed. Sound like before sleep, I try to go and memorize all of the mods there. I don't remember a single name of any mods. It's pointless noise information. Psych port. Yes, we are also going to go to the port location. Yes, 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 yes. It produces your missed shots, but my Uzi already doesn't miss any shots. <laughs> Uzi already misses zero shots. The sad part is that I don't have where to keep armor. I don't have space for the armor. That is the saddest part. Well, I have a chest here. With unsorted armor. Oh my God. So we're gonna drop it here. Your Matthew! Happy five months, Ark. Thank you for entertaining us and sacrificing your body for us. <laughs> Thank you, Matthew Spellman, for being here. Welcome, welcome to the stream. Thanks for being a member for five months in a row. Glad to see you here for such a long time. Welcome, welcome. Uh, let's take the Winchesters. Let's drop them here. Soon we're gonna have a rack full of Winchesters. That is gonna be sad. Okay, so almost the chopper is sorted out. Okay, 
Okay, that's cool. Let's... Uh, these guns. Now, let's check them out. Save them for recycling. That's why they're in the chest with the recyclers. With the recycling stuff. I usually keep here garbage on, and low durability weapons. So that's why I keep Winchesters there. It's the recycling chest. So yes, they are kept there for recycling. Alright, let's see the Uzi. That's the Uzi that I have now. And the times 4 Eliminator side. Ooh, it does more damage. But we do lose a little bit of crit shots. Um... Maybe it is the best. Maybe. Whatever. Let's get this mod then. Let's go for it. Let's assemble it. What do we need? What do we need? Uh, where is the Uzi? Here goes does the Uzi. Oof. Well, I'm gonna just take a picture on the phone. It'll be much better. See, guys, I live in the future. I have a camera on my phone. Do you have a camera? I doubt it. And I have a camera on my mobile device. What can you say about that, huh? But psych, I have a camera on my smartwatch. Nice. <laughs> Did I ask though? Uh, let's get the steel. Nah, but all jokes aside, peeps, I'm just kidding. It's cool that you have a, a camera on your smartwatch. Let's get the bolts, 40 bolts. Tap the delete in one week button after taking the picture. I wish there was a button like this. I wish there was a button. Another photo to the gallery of useless pictures. You guys have no idea how many pictures I have there. I wish it was possible. I mean, there, there is a, probably a way to see how many gigs of pictures I have there. Um... It's like, we don't really care how many gigs of pic- Stop it, and listen. I'm gonna tell you how much space is taken just by useless pictures. Just a second. Okay. I have no idea. In any case, let's just get the whatever stuff. What else did I need? <laughs> I lost the picture. <laughs> I lost the picture. Here, there's the storage loading. It's not that bad. I thought it's worse. I only have four, three gigs of pictures. And that's it. So it is not terrible at all. Well, we need 60 springs. Let's get 60 springs. One, two. Oh, let's get only 10. Sixty springs, eighteen factory parts. What on earth am I doing here? Mm, and eight carbon composites. That's it. Your chests are extremely organized. I'd love to organize my base as you, says Gary Millen. Just organize your base, that's it. Just take out a day of your... Just take... Just take a day off in last dinner. Don't clear that bond crowd, but sort your base and your base is gonna be sorted out. But I'm glad that you think that my base is organized. Thank you. Let's go to auto clicker. And ladies and gentlemen, here I'm gonna show you some black magic just between me and you. Don't... 
show that to anybody, okay? Check this out. You can modify guns insanely fast. Here you go, peeps. Look at this, peeps. Look at it. Brr. If that's not awesome, I have no idea what is awesome. That's it. I have added all the parts. Bam! And we've crafted the sight times four. So let's equip that sight times four now. And let's save it. So now that is the Uzi. Wait, I want to upgrade this other Uzi. Except I want to put this other old mod that I had. Okay, so from 11 you do 12 damage. Okay, kind of cool. Kind of cool. Understandable. Have a nice day. So yeah, that's now our Uzi. <laughs> God damn! Yeah, guys, it is a pretty nice Uzi. And it was satisfying on how we filled the parts. I'm the fastest mouse clicker in the world. Um, oh yeah, let's go to the port location. Let's get some more cement. The DPS is much higher. Well, I believe, I mean, we are doing 10 more damage per second, kind of, when you think about it. If we do one more, if we do 10 attacks per second, and we do one more damage per each attack, so that's 10 more damage per second. I guess that's cool. Let's get some stones. Um, what else can I bring there? Nothing, probably. I have everything else in the port location. Would you like to play the crater, please? As okay, Alfin. Do I look like I'd like to play crater? That's what I thought. Let's go to the port location. I woke up today in the morning and I was like, bruh, I'd love to go and play in the crater. Yeah, let's go, let's delete that picture. Oh, there's one more thing that I haven't done. We haven't repaired the grenade launchers and emptied the chopper. Chopper is already empty, isn't it? When is the next Dying Light to video? Tomorrow. Just as always, there's a new Dying Light to video every day. Yeah, there will be a new Dying Light video tomorrow. I just need to go and repair this grenade launcher. Have you played co-op for Dying Light? With whom am I gonna play co-op in Dying Light? You're asking questions as if, I don't know, Psych, have you ever tried... Uh, I don't even know, I don't even know. I can't even come up with any good examples. With whom am I gonna co-op in Dying Light? <laughs> and plus, but all jokes aside, I like the single player in Dying Light. Okay, let's go to the port location. When will upgrade all your weapons at once? When will that button come? I have no idea. Hopefully one day. Mm. Oh no, I came to the port location right away without going to the other place. Whatever, doesn't matter, we'll go there. Let's drop that here. Let's get the cement. Let's get the sand. And the water. That's it. We can get more cement. Waiting for the next video of Dying Light 2 says... I, sorry, can I read your name? I have no idea how to read that. But hey, I'm glad that you're enjoying Dying Light 2 videos.
But yeah, Dying Light 2 is awesome. I'm glad it was worth the wait. I'm, I'm loving Dying Light. It's amazing. Let's go to the gas station. And let's repair that grenade launcher. And also, there will be some sort of black market. Maybe there we'll be able to buy something useful. Make some God of War as well. There will be God of War live stream. There will be God of War live stream soonish. Like, no worries. We will finish God of War. I mean, I don't want to promise anything. I don't like promising anything because you know me and my promises. But I think that we will finish that day's... God of War. I just don't know when. We will finish it during live streams. There are like two, three live streams left, and we will finish it. I just don't know when, but no worries. I will finish it. Let's get it. Let's get the grenade launcher in here. Look at me. I have the Sky Scout's armor. The Boy Scout. Give it the Boy Scout's word. We will finish the, the God of War. Okay, let's... Rep we've repaired one grenade launcher. Let's do a spin over here. We got two spins. 800 caps go on VIP caps now 400 caps is all right. That's pretty decent, but I'd love to get purple caps now, please Pretty please 400 again. That's 800 caps Pretty decent if you ask me. Okay, let's get that and all of those items were already here in the storage When is the new episode of last earth free to play coming when I come up with a with an idea of what I could do there besides just clearing bunker alpha um, titanium, beautiful. C force, beautiful. Grenades, beautiful. Amazing. That was insane black market. I don't really know anything else that I could buy here, but we bought what we had to. That was seriously dope stuff. Dope, dope stuff. Pick a blinders guy laughing at your shorts. What would he know? What would he know about style? Waiting for the new Peaky Blinders season. I have no idea when it's going to come out, but it should come out probably soon, hopefully. Hopefully. Okay, let's drop this stuff here. Nice. Spin the caps. I'll save more caps. Like, 800 caps isn't a lot. I don't want to spin the cap. Spin the caps yet. But at least we've gotten some titanium today. So that's nice. And you know what? We could get the buff. Why not? Do I really need the buff? I mean, it... I'll get the buff. Why not? Maximum health pull increase here. We have 140 health. So yeah, let's get that all back to the base. Let's drop the loot. So yeah, I'm happy that we were able to get the titanium. Flare is the best way to kill a frenzy giant. I have no idea where I've gotten that information from, but... Okay. Alright. Have you watched Witcher series, series on Netflix? Yes, I've seen all the two seasons. It's great. I think it's awesome. Go, let's drop the C4. The grenade launcher goes over here. If there's space, yeah, there's just enough space for the grenade launcher. The titanium. Um, grenades. Meds, and that's it. Let's drop the cement. Cement, cement. Okay, so I gotta drop cement over here for a second. I got lost what I, what I came here for. But we came for cement. Have you tried Far Cry? I've played Far Cry 3. Far Cry 3 is awesome. I haven't played other Far Cries, but Far Cry 3. I've played Far Cry Primal. I don't think I've beaten it, but I've played Far Cry Primal. It's awesome as well. But I've played Far Cry Primal before I moved to France. And when I moved to France, I've kind of forgotten about it. And that's it. But yeah, Far Cry Primal is amazing. And Far Cry 3 was amazing. And I'm pretty certain other Far Cry uh, Far Cries were amazing. And yeah, I think we will be kind of wrapping it up little by little. So yeah, thanks peeps for joining here. That was quite epic.
So yeah, thanks for being here. See you guys tomorrow with another live stream. Yeah, see you tomorrow with another live stream, just as just as usual. Another live stream, another video, another Dying Light to video. So if you haven't started watching Dying Light to videos, I highly suggest you start to, to watch it because it's an awesome post-apocalyptic zombie game. So make sure to check it out. So yeah, take care, everybody. Thanks for joining here. See you later, everyone. And see you tomorrow with another live stream, just as usual, and another Dying Light to video. Uh, no Rubik's Cube, I guess. I mean, I have really nothing much to show with the Rubik's Cube. Once I get a bit better, if I ever get the time to practice more, we'll be able... I'll be able to solve the Rubik's Cube faster, but now it takes two minutes. It's nothing really much to solve there. We've solved it once. But, uh... Yeah, there's nothing much left to do. Once I get better, I'll be able to maybe show off something here. Once I get at least sub one minute, then I'll be able to show something more. But yeah, thanks for joining here. Take care, everyone. Shout out to all of you. Glad. Uh, it was awesome to chat with all of you here. And, oh, we've gotten the super chat. So before we go, we're going to read the super chat from Brown Knight. Will you consider doing a collab with Kefir and the giveaways? Much love from Houston, Texas. Thank you for the super chat, Brown Knight. And, uh... The problem with giveaways, I'm usually not the biggest fan of giveaways. Will you consider doing a collab with Kafir and do giveaways? Much love from Houston, Texas. Thank you for the super chat. Welcome, welcome to the stream once again. Uh, the point with giveaways is that there are always more problems than positivity with those giveaways because there will be a lot of people participating and uh, only like what, five or like 10 people can win. And uh, I keep getting a lot of DMs about like, hey, psych, when there's another giveaway, why I didn't win, giveaways are rigged, or like whatever else. I get just masses of people spamming me with uh, with negative things about giveaways. So I usually don't like to participate in any giveaways. I usually don't organize any giveaways because every time there's a giveaway, there's always a lot of negativity surrounding them. Hopefully that's understandable. I know that maybe some other people do it somehow, some way. I don't know, but just for me, in my scenario, there's always a lot of negativity surrounding it. At least that's how it feels like for me. Like, it's always awesome to do a giveaway, but every time someone's not going to win, they'll keep texting me that they didn't win something or whatever. And it's just, I don't know. I don't know. It's it's not a good vibe for me. It doesn't feel good. So, the the way I solve it is just there is no giveaway at all. <laughs> That's how I solve it. So, hopefully that makes sense. Hopefully you understand what I'm trying to say here. And, yeah. So yeah, take care, everybody. Thanks for everything once again. And peace out, everybody. Take care, peeps. Take care, take care, everybody.